How dare you raise your hand on me? See what I do to your kid now! Ugh! Don't you ever touch my son again! You don't know what you've done. I gave you what you deserved. The first slap was for my son. You said he had no manners. The second was for me. You called me a witch. Want a third? This isn't over! Just wait! Mom, you're so strong! Excuse me, Mrs. Claire. I'm so sorry you had to deal with that. <sighs> it's okay, but I hope this doesn't become a regular thing. It won't. We'll handle it. That kind of behavior is unacceptable. I appreciate it. Liam shouldn't have to go through this. Hey, buddy, you did nothing wrong. We're gonna make sure this doesn't happen again, okay? Okay. Let's go home, sweetheart. It's been a long day. Hey, Liam. How are you, champ? Dad, something happened in school after you left. What happened, Liam? There was a mean lady. She pushed me and took my bear. She did what? Who was this woman? <sighs> Another parent. She was... out of line. I had to step in. Are you okay? Mom protected me. She slapped her. Twice! You did? Yes. No one touches my son. We'll make sure this doesn't happen again. Yes, we'll... <sighs> I need a shower. It's been a rough day. Hello? You must be the husband. You and your whole family are going to regret what your wife did to me. Who is this? <laughs> you don't know me, but I know Natalie. She'll pay for what she did. If you ever threaten her again, you'll regret it. We'll see about that. Well, look who it is. The beggars have returned. Step aside. You think you can just... Walk away after what you did to my wife. Your wife was out of line. She got what she deserved. You have no idea who you're dealing with. We'll make your life a living hell. We're not afraid of you. Now move. You're going to regret ever crossing us. You're pathetic. Bullying a child and his mother? Is this how you teach your own children to behave? You've got a big mouth for someone who doesn't belong here. Maybe we should teach you a lesson. Touch me or my son, and you'll see what a real fight looks like. She talks a lot, baby. Go and shut her up. Yes, I've to return some favors. Who is this? And you're about to find out just how wrong you are. Is there a problem here? Daddy, you're here! Yay! Daddy? What the f- who do you think you are interfering in our business? This is between us and this woman. Honey, please! Stay out of this, or you'll regret it. I think you're mistaken. You don't know who you're talking to. Oh, I'm so scared. Like I care who you are. Please, let's go. This isn't worth it. You think you can scare me? Think again. I suggest you listen to your husband and leave. Now. You're making things worse. Let's go! What the hell happened to you? Don't tell me what to do. You're going to get us in trouble. I'm not scared of him, or you. I... I'm sorry. She's out of her mind. She doesn't know who you are. I can't believe you're siding with him. <sighs> Let's just go. We've caused enough trouble. I'm, I'm sorry, Mr. Claire. She's just upset. I, I... I apologize. Causing trouble is exactly what you've done. Mr. Claire? Rice Claire? I, I, I understand, Mr. Claire. It won't happen again. Please, forgive us. Daddy, I want that bear. Make him give it to me. Keep quiet. I don't want to see you again. Are you and Liam all right? Yes, we're fine. Thank you for coming. But how did you know? It's a long story, and Liam is getting late for his class. Why aren't you in bed yet? Just needed some water. Thank you, by the way. Thank you? For what? For today. No need to thank me. I'm his father. It's what I should do. Um, thanks again. 
Hello? Hi, Natalie. This is Sarah from Fresh Faces. We've been following Tony's work, and we're impressed. We'd like to invite him to be a guest on our show next week. Oh, wow, that's fantastic news. Tony will be thrilled. Thank you so much for considering him. You're welcome. We see great potential in him. Can you confirm his availability for tomorrow? Let me check with him. I'll get back to you shortly. Hey, Natalie, what's up? Tony, I have amazing news. Fresh Faces wants you on their show next week. No way. Are you serious? Absolutely serious. They love your work and want to feature you. Wow, Natalie. Thank you so much for making this happen. I can't believe it. You deserve it, Tony. This is just the beginning. I'll clear my schedule for tomorrow. Tell them I'm in. <laughs> it's me who makes your schedules. I'll confirm with Sarah right away. Get ready for your spotlight. Yes, yes, yes! Hey, Sarah, what's up? Natalie, I've got bad news. The producers at Fresh Faces have decided not to feature Tony on the show. What? Why? <sighs> they said they received some negative feedback about Tony's recent social media posts. They think it could be controversial. Controversial? Those posts were harmless. This is unfair. I know, Natalie. I argued with them, but they wouldn't budge. I... I'm really sorry. Damn it! We worked so hard for opportunities like this. Tony is counting on this. He is very excited. I know it's disappointing, but maybe we can find another way to boost Tony's career. We'll figure something out. No, Sarah. This was our shot, and they're taking it away unjustly. I'm going to talk to them myself. Natalie, be careful. They're not easy to convince. I don't care. They can't just shut Tony out like this. Thanks for letting me know, Sarah. I am not losing this easily. Get out of my way, Howard. I'm not moving. Ugh! How dare you touch me! Oh, come on. Don't be like that. Move. Can't we at least have a civilized conversation? There's nothing to talk about. Let me go. Ugh! What do you want? I just want to treat you to a meal. <laughs> Don't even think about it. Quit following me. Let me think about it. Um, no. Howard, I'm sick of you. Now, if you don't want me to create a scene here, let me go. What if I tell you that I can get you that Fresh Faces show right now? What? It was me who had Tony removed from the show. But I can make sure he gets back on. All you have to do is have lunch with me. You're an arrogant dog, Howard. Using your influence to manipulate others? Business is business, and I know you need me more than you think. I don't need anything from you, least of all your interference. Oh, but you do. You need me to fix this mess. And trust me, I can do a lot more than that. And what's in it for you, Howard, besides satisfying your ego? Maybe I just want to get to know you better. Save the charm. It won't work on me. I'll never... Forget what you did to me that night. Look, Natalie, I'm offering you a way out of this. Take it or leave it. But know that without me, Tony's chances are slim. Fine. One lunch. But after that, you stay out of my life and Tony's. Deal. And oh, we're standing right outside a cafe. Let's go in. <sighs> what have I gotten myself into? What the... Bryce, isn't that Natalie? With Howard? What the hell is she doing with Howard again? How will Bryce react to this meeting? Will he intervene to protect Natalie from Howard's influence? What does Howard really want from Natalie beyond manipulating Tony's TV appearance? What consequences will unfold as Natalie delves deeper into Howard's world? To find out what happens next, Download the Pocket FM app. Link in description.